I'm not one of the mayor's favorites and the feeling is quite mutual because people are still living in these conditions and it's more than 20 years after our democracy and the situation in informal settlements is not really improving. To live in this condition, you need to see the brighter side of life because you don't want to live for always like this. You want to be in some place where it's much better than this. Just to see the light to breathe fresh air in the morning, for me, that, that, is, that is the best thing that can ever happen to you because you can still walk, you can still see. And if, if that wasn't there, then I could complain much more, but at least I got something. Most of my friends outside are just like, like in them doing drugs, maybe they they, they they hang with the gangsters, you know, they're standing late on the corners, robbing people, you know. So I said, okay, now nah, maybe like if I try to dance, it will make me a better person. The way I think, you know, the way I like look look after myself, you know, the way I talk to people. People really change, change me, you know, like as a dancer and as a person. After apartheid, because the, the Western Cape is it's DA controlled, I think the ANC is um, discriminating against the colored people. I think the colored people will leave behind after apartheid because, you know, away jobs are gone and things. I think they are also uh, being classified as colored, so if a job advertises, um, I think it should just go to a colored or a black person. They shouldn't, you know, discriminate between a colored and a black. We were all definitely being discriminated yeah. against, especially with the development of the communities. If you go to black areas to see all the NGOs, non-government organizations are getting money from the government to uplift the community. And if you go into Lavendil, I'm just on your hand, you.